this is Lani from Full of Joy Yoga and Mindful Yoga Breaks, and it is Free Your Mind Friday. So um, today, since it is the start of a vacation for many people, um, I wanted to just do something pretty simple. So um, tomorrow is the solstice, and in my family we have an, our annual solstice celebration where we have a fire lots of lights, kids plant bulbs, we do all kinds of fun traditional things in our family here at our house. Um, this whole month I've been um, celebrating light and, ha and I explained that to you guys last week in Free Your Mind Friday. But one of my favorite meditations that I which um, helps bring attention and focus, it's also really good for memory. Um, and for kids especially, this is just a great focus and attention meditation they can do. We use tea lights. So I have this tea light. It's kind of hard to see in the light in the, the light coming in my apartment, but I'm going to go like this, and you can kind of see on my hand what happens. This light, this tea light changes colors, and it does it really subtly. So it's pretty cool on my hand, actually. So, um, as it goes from color to color, if you sit and just do an, uh, an eye gaze meditation, it's called Trataka, and this eye gaze meditation you can do with a regular candle flame, you can do it with a tea light that changes colors, or you can do it with just a regular tea light. And um, I, at the yoga studio where I teach, they also put the tea lights into... Um, other uh, candle holders so it really shines a bright a really beautiful um, light but for you and your kids um, what I would do is just take a tea light and one that changes colors and I'll put the link to where I get it on Amazon um, and I'm gonna full disclosure I try not to shop on on Amazon too much I've gotten many holiday gifts and other gifts um, at local with like craft, fair, craft fairs and little toy stores, but I actually do shop on Amazon here and there when needed, and these tea lights are really easy to find. <coughs> and I'm nursing this cough. So um, I'm going to put the link to the tea lights that I really like um, in this post. So I set this tea light down, and kids can lie on their bellies, or you can sit up crisscross on a bolster or a blanket and just watch the lights change. And it's mesmerizing. It calms the monkey mind, all those thoughts. And right now, people are a little frenzied and harried because of the holidays and gift you know, buying and you know all the food you need to make and family and travel and just, it's endless what's going on right now. So if you can have a way of just calming that um, monkey mind, all the, the thoughts going on in your brain at any given time, um, even for a minute, it's really helpful, just as like a little reset of the brain. So um, I, the next thing I do is I'll ask the kids. So um, just pay attention to the light and then notice which is your favorite color. So I'm going to put my hand here again and maybe you can pick your favorite color. So there's many different shades because it is changing from one color to the next. And so the kids love to point out which one is their favorite. Um, so pick your favorite as it's changing from color to color. And the kids sit nice and calm and still, focused, quiet. Just a way to bring the energy level down. Very grounding. So enjoy on this shortest day of the year tomorrow. Um, and happy solstice, happy winter. Stay warm, stay bright, find joy, find peace, hopefully with friends, with family, food, fun, all the good stuff. Um, and if you need a hug, make sure to either give it to yourself or find somebody to give it to you because you know what can really help you in these frenzied, harried times is just asking somebody for a hug, something you probably didn't even realize you needed in that moment. Um, so happy solstice. And I'll probably next time I'll see you on Free Your Mind Fridays after Christmas and during still during Hanukkah Festival of Lights. Um, so happy Hanukkah, happy Christmas, happy Kwanzaa, and all that you happy solstice, and all that you celebrate this next week. See ya.